Lifeguards are preparing for huge crowds and more possible rescues. There is a rip current warning right now. Let's get to attention reporter Matt Mendez, who's live at Mission Beach. Matt, you got to see firsthand what it's like to swim in a rip current. Yeah, Virginia, I actually went out there in the ocean on this boogie board, and it was really difficult with that current pulling you in. Now, lifeguards say on hot days like this weekend, they're expecting to see anywhere between 20 to 25,000 people at Mission Beach alone. So lifeguards are, of course, on full staff this weekend. Their main concern today, though, are those rip currents, actually. And I wanted to find out what it was like swimming in a rip current. So I put on a wetsuit. I had a lifeguard nearby, and I went out about 75 yards. The current pulled me in. I ditched my, my boogie board. I could no longer touch the ocean floor, and it was very hard trying to swim. I was out of breath, and those waves were just crashing up against me. And that's when my rescuer, Sergeant Rick Strobel, helped pull me in. You were kicking really hard, and then you left your boogie board thinking that you could swim in, but you can't. What you want to do is you want to stay on your boogie board. You want to raise your hand for assistance, and we'll come and get you. I'm breathing hard, too. I was tired. And lifeguards also say not to panic and to swim parallel. They uh, have a bunch of warning signs out there, and uh, they, they say that the, the water may look inviting. It's 68 degrees, the, the temperature, but also just to be very careful and also swim near lifeguard stations. Reporting live in Mission Beach, Matt Mendes, 10 News. Matt, thank you.